Hi, I'm Carlos, and I'm an application engineer at MathWorks. I want to show you how MATLAB and Simulink can simplify the complex task of robotics, path planning, and navigation. This is something all autonomous robots need to do regardless of the application, whether it's a self-driving vehicle like this one that needs to park in this parking lot, a cleaning robot that needs to move around your house, or a flying robot that needs to deliver a package. Now, I don't have a self-driving car, but that didn't stop me. I've implemented a simulation in MATLAB and Simulink based on three components, a reference path, a robot model, and a path following algorithm. So let me show you how I implemented this simulation. First, we need to create a reference path, and I did this in MATLAB, where I've developed a function that creates a map of the environment. So the next step is to actually create the path. For this, I've implemented an A star planner because it considers the kinematics of the vehicle but you can use one of the built-in algorithms in MATLAB as well. So here we see the reference path. Now I need to load this reference path in Simulink. So let me switch back to Simulink. Here I have the reference path. Now we need a robot model. For the robot model, I'm using the differential equations of the bicycle model because it's simple and easy to implement. But in Simulink, you can customize your model to be as complex as you need. So we have the reference path, we have the robot model, we just need our path following algorithm. In this case, I'm using the built-in pure pursuit controller because it's commonly used in robotics. And MATLAB and Simulink have many robotics algorithms and built-in blocks that you can use as is or customize. So great, we have the three components that we need to run the simulation. Let's run it. Now we see the vehicle following the path and reaching the desired destination. I think this is pretty cool. What's even cooler is that you can go further and design a more complex system, such as a model predictive controller, for example. You can also automatically generate code for your favorite hardware board or robotics middleware, like ROS. Regardless of your particular application for your robot, you can start using these blocks for your algorithm. So download the robotics trial and see it for yourself.